What's up y'all, I'm Kyle from Driving and Vibing and you're watching Road Gear Reviews. Today we're gonna talk about an economical cell booster that is new to the market, so stick around. All right guys, today we're talking about the Surecall Cell Booster. This is the Fusion To Go 2.0 and it is used in a car, you can use it in an RV, a boat, a lot of different applications for this. Let us just disclaim very quickly that we use a WeBoost cell booster in our RV and we don't plan on switching cell boosters anytime soon because we've been very happy with the WeBoost. But when Surecall reached out to us, they offered to send us one of these units for us to test and we thought it would be a great time to present the test results and uh, share them with you guys because this unit right here costs about $299 and that's $200 less expensive than a Weeboo system. So there is a noticeable price difference here. So we're gonna test it and see what the uh, results are. So hang around for that, but before we get into that, let me show you what this kit is made of. All right, the first piece is the main boosting station. This is very similar to the one we have with our WeBoost. It's about the same size, it's set up the same way. This one has lights to let you know what signals are being boosted. If you're familiar with cell boosters, this will look pretty common because basic design, very simple function. On the outside antenna, it comes with this very big but sleek white uh, antenna. And I think for RVs this would be great, for marine devices this would be great. They even show material on their website for home usage. So while it's almost a foot in length, it is pretty sleek with the color and the uh, cylindrical design here. And then lastly, the other side of the main boosting station is this small interior antenna. And what this does is project the boosted cell signal to your devices. So that might be an iPhone, a hotspot, whatever device you're accessing the internet with, this in interior antenna will give that the boosted signal. Now, Surecall's booster does work on all internet providers, all cell services, Sprint, Verizon, T-Mobile, AT&T, no matter which one you got. If there is a signal to be boosted, this will pull that signal in and boost it, and you can use multi multiple devices on multiple networks at the same time. The only issue is that these smaller antennas have been known to not be able to project the boosted signal very far, so you need to put your device close to this. We usually set our hotspot right on top of it, or if we're making a phone call, sometimes we'll even pick it up and hold it to the back of the cell phone. So while you can use multiple devices, it's pretty challenging to be just because this is not putting out a huge signal on the inside. But that's no different from other boosters we've used. So that makes up of what this unit is comprised of. You know, it also comes with the cable you need. It comes with some mounting devices that will make it easier to install. But those are the basic components, very similar to other boosters we've used in the past. And uh, the quality all seems to be on par. So there's no big difference and no surprises with what we're getting in this package. Now we'll get into the test results we run. So if you don't know much about how cell signal works and the numbers used to measure it, it's pretty basic. It comes in a number form and the larger the number, the weaker the signal is. So for example, right now we're out in the boonies in Utah and with no boosters used, just our AT&T hotspot alone, we're getting negative 93 decibels. That equals about three bars is what AT&T tells us. So not awful, but we're not able to stream without buffering with that negative 94 decibel measurement. So once we hooked up the Surecall cell booster, we definitely saw a noticeable increase in our cell signal that we're receiving. And the decibel measurement at this point was negative 53. And with that negative 53 decibels, that was full bars is how it showed us as far as the bars are lined up on that visual. And we were able to stream Netflix with no buffering. So it made a noticeable difference. And lastly, we tested the Wii Boost and how much that boosted the signal, just so we can have a base comparison between these two cell boosters. And whenever we hooked up the Wii Boost, we got negative 49 decibels. Again, that's full bars, streaming Netflix, and that's just a uh, four decibel difference. I can't notice a difference with the speeds with that four decibel difference. So I would have to say for the price of this Surecall, definitely worthwhile in this environment. Now, as we travel the country, cell service varies so much. And uh, I'm sure the performance of these boosters would also vary in certain locations, depending the tower signal that's being put out. So just to know in this situation, 
I would say the $200 price difference for the Surecall sounds like a great value because that's a good savings and it boosted the signal almost as much as the Wii Boost. But we have to stand by our WeBoost as well because we've been using it for a year and a half now and have seen great results throughout the country. With that said, if you are on a budget, if you're looking for a more economical choice, I would say do a little more research about this SureCall Fusion 2.0 to go because from the test results, it seems like it still boosts the signal from a buffered Netflix experience to a no buffering, easy stream Netflix experience. So that is the SureCall Cell Boost Fusion to Go 2.0. Challenging name, we'll link it below. And uh, check it out for yourself, see what you think about it. But at $2.99, that seems like a great price. And uh, yeah, I would say it's definitely worth checking out. We'll link it below. If you use one of these units and have traveled across the US with it, let us know your experience. Let us know if it holds up over time and also if it boosts the signal consistently throughout your travels. I'm Kyle, you're watching Road Gear Reviews. Give this video a big thumbs up if it helped you out. Share it with your friends and we'll see you guys next time, later on.